Springfield Mayor Dom Sarno said the state is dumping homeless families in Springfield. 22 News reporter David McKay spoke with some of the people placed in apartment buildings. The homeless I spoke with today that live in some of the apartments in question were mostly from the Boston area and agreed what the mayor had to say. About 1,500 homeless live in hotels and motels across the state, and some have been moved into Springfield apartments. And Mayor Dominic Sarno says the city is overburdened. The numbers are staggering that are brought here, all for the almighty dollar. The mayor's office says 450 homeless families are staying in Springfield. About 175 live in co-shelter units. The city of Springfield has identified about 86 co-shelter units in the lower Belmont Avenue area. A co-shelter unit means that more than one family occupies one apartment unit, each family occupying one bedroom. That's why city code enforcement has been sent in to assess living situations. Not four families should be placed in a four bedroom apartment and sharing one bedroom with two to three, I mean one to two kids, you know what I mean, and three people probably in total, you know what I mean. I've been a long term resident and I've paid my taxes which go back into the city and go into our schools and I raise a family here and I am concerned because we have a lot of things going on on Belmont Avenue. The Department of Housing and Economic Development told 22 News they are working to move families from three families per unit housing so they would live with only one other family. Our storage is in Boston. Our life is in Boston. There is also concern that those being moved aren't getting the support system they could get from being in an area where they're from. You can see statements from the mayor's office and the state housing and economic office on our website at WWLP.com. Live in the studio, David McKay, 22 News.